Diamond Phillips here. What brings yes. you uh, Well, my wife Yvonne and uh, our daughter Indigo, and uh, you know, I mean, come on, when Winnie the Pooh throws a party, wow. I mean, uh, it's, uh, and Tigger's got tiger, you know, blood and uh, Adonis DNA, so it's, uh, they're, they're winning, I think. Now, in your household, do you have a favorite character in the Hundred Acre Wood? Oh, my goodness. Think it'd be Winnie. Yeah, probably Winnie, you know, pretty partial to Eeyore. Um, and she, I don't know, she, she's uh, really off into Yo Gabba these days and uh, Dora, I mean, the, the whole gamut. So, uh, I mean, uh, knowing that a lot of the characters are going to be here, she likes to hobnob, you know, with the, uh, the animated stars. Now, do you remember the first time you saw Winnie the Pooh in the theaters or on TV? Oh, <laughs> now you're taking me back. I saw Winnie the Pooh in theaters. I, they won an Oscar back in what, the late, late 50s. Uh, I uh, wasn't more till 62, but I, did, I do remember seeing uh, Pooh in the theaters like in the, in the late 60s, early 70s, that sort of thing. What are you most looking forward to seeing in this new Pooh? Um, slapstick. I'm really, because she, she's, she's part German, she's got a little Schoedenfreude, so, you know, when anybody falls down, it's pretty darn funny to her. So we're, uh, we're definitely going for the slapstick today. Out of all the two movies, which one's your favorite? Oh, my goodness. Blustery Day. The Blustery Day, that's a good one. I think that's the one that won the Oscar, wasn't it? It might have been. Yeah. That's a good one. And question of the day, do you think Pete will find his honey at the end of the day? You know, in Hollywood, it's really hard to find your honey. I found mine, so uh, I think Pooh's got a good shot. I'm, I'm pretty sure this is going to have a happy ending. Okay, thank you. You bet. Thank you.